At 1.30 a.m., the Francis Scott Key Bridge in Baltimore collapsed. What the f What the f Here's how the events unfolded. Maryland Governor Wes Moore said a cargo ship from Singapore called the Dolly made a mayday call when their power went out and they lost control of their vessel. They told authorities a collision was possible, and emergency personnel raced to the scene to stop further traffic from driving onto the bridge. I need one of you guys on the south side, one of you guys on the north side, hold all traffic on the key bridge. Uh, there's a ship approaching that just lost their steering. So until you get that under control, we gotta stop all traffic. Construction workers were on the bridge at the time, pouring concrete. Uh, there's a crew up there. You might want to notify whoever the foreman is, see if we can get them off the bridge temporarily. Video shows the ship's lights go off, then on again, then off again, just before the ship hits the column. And at 1.30 a.m., it hits, causing people on the bridge to plummet into the river below. C-13 dispatch, the whole bridge just fell down. Start, start is whoever, everybody. The whole bridge just collapsed. It is crazy, dude. As of Tuesday morning, authorities said two of the construction workers had been rescued from the water, but six were still unaccounted for. And there are 22 crew members aboard the ship, including two pilots, all of them Indian nationals and all of them uninjured. A state of emergency has been declared and an investigation is now underway. Around noon, President Biden said the federal government would pay for repairs. When asked whether the ship should be held responsible for those financial costs, he responded. That should be, but we're not going to wait for that happen. We're going to pay for it to get the bridge rebuilt and opened.